hey y'all just a quick word about dna testing yeah boom now i'm not one to be liking to give out my dna and these things yeah but see this how this is what we've got to do these times because some people don't know who their baby father is for whatever reason why you don't know who your baby father is then yeah or as the man you don't know if the child is yours for whatever reason just for whatever reason say there's 10 men and the woman wants to test him that and none of these 10 men don't want to take the dna test but all of these 10 men know that they slept with the woman plus on top of that the woman's offering to pay for all of the 10 10 dna tests herself give her the dna test in it or all of them 10 men should be locked up for six months that's what i feel because if you know that you've slept with somebody and this person's do you know how much do you know what it is for a woman to say she doesn't know who the father of her child is first do you know then what it is for her to go and say to each of these men, I need a DNA test? You don't know how much courage that took her. And now, on top of that, you're going to say to her, no. <laughs> and she said, I'll pay for it. And you're going to say to her, no. From personal experience, I have a baby father. I've got a 14 year old son. From personal experience, yeah, this man has is adamant that this child is not his. Until I've had to search back into my brain and think, who did I sleep with, whatever, so whatever. Whatever again. It's an injustice against these children. It's an injustice against yourself and it's an injustice against the woman that's admitted now. She's admitted it, you get it? Right, cool. I'm in a situation where one guy called Dean, he was going around telling people that he's the father of my child. Right? Now I said to this guy, look, if you that's how you feel, I'll pay for the DNA test. Let's get it done because I know that you're not his dad, isn't it? Right. Then my baby father. Well, the, the person I'm saying is the dad, yeah. He's so adamant, yeah, that I'm like, well, let me, let me test this guy, in it, Because, you know, old people, my baby father is old, he's older than my parents, yeah. Like, the, the father of my child is older than my parents. I'm saying, well, well, he's an old man. He might know something that I don't know, in it. So let me just test this guy. Right, cool. Then there's a next guy called Junior, yeah, that... I remember Junior coming to my house. I remember Junior leaving. I don't remember what we did in between that time. Okay. Now, this is honesty and truthfulness, isn't it? If someone's going to be honest and truthful, then and the only way to move forward is to do a DNA test. Then let's do the DNA test, isn't it? So the, the father that I think is the child, he won't do the DNA test neither. So that's three people that won't do a DNA test. You know what I'm saying? But one's actually saying that he's the father he won't do the dna test the one that's saying that he's not the father who i'm saying you are like jollof i'm saying you're the father of my child you should come and take a dna test all till now the boy's 14 and i'm saying i'll pay for it and it's at this stage now it's ridiculous it's silly in it and for you free know that you're not the father of the child come and take the dna test in it it's that simple publicly this is publicly now you get me publicly so Yeah, when you're 21 and you drink and you smoke, you don't remember really timelines and all of these things there. Me personally, I don't even think I slept with Junior. Like, deep down inside my heart, that's what I believe. I don't think we had sex. And he remembers and I don't. So I'm saying, if you remember and you're saying you don't know, then let's take this DNA test, isn't it? You're saying you don't know, but you're saying he's definitely not your child. And I'm saying, this old man is so adamant, you know, <laughs> that it's not his. Yeah, that let's just do it in it let's just do it it can only come back that he's not yours in it especially if we didn't even have sex why are you so scared because what well, you now think that if it's yours you're gonna to have to take care of this responsibility it's ridiculous it's ridiculous honestly dean i had two periods two it's not your child bro and if that's how you really feel take the dna test from 2018 i've been saying to dean let's take the dna test yeah this boy was born in 2008. From 2010, I've been saying to Jollof, let's take the DNA test, yeah? From the boy was born, I said to Junior, we might have to take a DNA test, you know? I think that we should anyway, because I don't remember what happened. I remember you come to my house, but I don't remember what happened. As I said, deep down inside, I don't feel like I've slept with this guy. My point is, yeah, if you know you've had sex with the woman, take the DNA test. It can only say yes or no. And if there's three, only one of you can be the father. That means only one of you has to take responsibility. Why would you not just take the DNA test? So when they're saying that there's men out there that will have sex with women and trap them and leave them with the baby, it's true. It's true. 
It is true. And then they would leave them not only with the child but with doubt. That's that's do you know how evil that is? So it must be evil, wouldn't it? So all three of them are evil. So what you say, what have you learned, Bookie? Keep your legs closed. Don't let no one text you. You can say whatever you want. You can bring down two stars out of the sky and give it to me. I'll give that right back to Mosai and say, Mosai, I prefer a man to commit to me properly before I have sex with anybody. And if you're not going to commit to me, I'm not having sex. Why not? Why should I? To get pregnant and, and the man run away again. At least if we're married, yeah, but it's automatically yours. <laughs> That's what women don't know. If you have a baby in your marriage, it's automatically your husband's get married. Stop making these men leave us out here with kids and making us look stupid. We're all willing to try to fix and solve the problem here, but these men ain't. Calm down. Do the right thing.